in this video we will learn about indian system of numeration let's get started indian system of numeration let's learn how we can use this system in reading and writing the large numbers here is the table here ones thousands lakhs crores this all are called periods i repeat ones thousands lakhs crores this all are called periods if you see here the numbers from 1 to 9 this all are called places i repeat here the numbers from 1 to 9 this all are called places so in a table we have periods and places these places helps us to know from where we can start reading the large numbers for example i have a six digit number i can start reading that number from lakhs because the sixth place is what here lakhs in this way we can use this places here in one period we have three places ones at first place tens second place hundreds third place in thousands periods thousand is in fourth place ten thousand is in fifth place again in lakhs period lakhs is in sixth place ten lakhs is in seventh place similarly in crores period the crore is in eighth place 10 crores is in ninth place students here we are learning up to only crores because in six standard it is given up to only crores in this system we use ones tens hundreds thousands lakhs and crores i hope you understand about this table i repeat this table has periods and places these places are helpful in reading the large numbers we use commas in indian system of numeration it's really very most important thing for reading and writing the large numbers let's see commas helps us in reading and writing the large numbers these are used for reading and writing the large numbers now the question is how we can use these commas let's see first comma after three digits that is after one period we discuss about these periods so here we have to put first comma after the three digits from the right side i repeat we have to put the first comma after three digits from the right side you have to count the three digits from the right side and then put the first comma second comma after next two digits that is after thousands period after putting the first comma from there we have to leave the two digits or you can say two places after that we have to put the second comma third comma comes again after next two digits that is after lakhs period so here also same after putting the second comma we have to leave the two digits or you can say two places and put the third comma like this we have to put the commas well you might have confusion don't worry i will show you a diagram from that you can easily understand how to put the commas let's see about that here comes the first comma the first comma we have to put after the three digits from the right side keep in mind put the commas always from the right side so the first comma is after the three digits that is after once period the second comma is after the two digits after putting the first comma see here after putting the first comma after this comma again we have to leave the two digits or you can say the two places after that we have to put the second comma that is after thousands period i repeat we have to put the second comma after the two digits in the same way the third comma is after again the two digits see here after putting the second comma again we have to leave the two digits or you can say the two places then after we have to put the third comma 
so we have to put the third comma after the lakhs period so leaving the lakhs and 10 lakhs place finally here comes the crores period in sixth standard we are learning up to only crores as it is in our syllabus up to crores only after this crores also we have the numbers for that also we have to put comma after every two digits now the fourth comma comes after here after these two digits here we have to put the comma after crores and 10 crores places i hope you understand how to put these commas how to use the commas i repeat again and again because this is very important topic these commas helps us in reading and writing the large numbers so here the first comma is after three digits that is after one period we have to put the comma from the right side count the digits from the right side and put the comma the second comma is after the two digits that is after thousands period after putting the first comma just leave the two places or you can say the two digits and put the second comma then again same thing we have to follow here after putting the second comma again leave the two digits or two places then put the third comma then here becomes the crores period we are stopping here only in this our video because we have only crores in our syllabus here observing this diagram we can notice one thing in this system the first comma is after the three digits then remaining all commas are after every two 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 digits you observe this diagram here see here the first comma is after three digits from the right side so the remaining all commas are after two two digits see here one two then second comma again leaving two digits one two again we have to put the third comma similarly here also we have to leave the two places or two digits one two and here we have to put the fourth comma i hope you understand about this putting the commas and use of commas so here is the important note here in this system only the first comma is after three digits as i told you before it's very easy to remember how to put the comma just you have to remember this only first comma the first comma is after three digits then all remaining commas are after every two digits so in this system only the first comma is after three digits remaining commas are after every two digits now we will see how we can read the number by using this commas one more important thing here after the first comma this is the thousands period after second comma this is the lakhs period after third comma is a crores period here we have total three commas one two if in a large number if you see the three commas then you have to start reading the number from crores if in a large number if you see only two commas then you have to start reading the number from lakhs how simple it is see here just because of the commas just you have to remember these commas how to put let us see some examples and read that number here comes the first example in this example total i have eight digits so for first let us see how to put the comma so here the first comma is after three digits from the right side so one two three so here the first comma it means after one period then after leaving the two digits we have to put the second comma that is thousands period then after again leaving the two digits we have to put the another comma that is the lakhs period so in this example if you observe this one here we have three commas total how many commas here one two three so three commas means we have to start reading this number from yes you are right we have we have to start reading the number from crores let us read this number together five crores 23 lakhs 64,219 see how very simple it is 
reading the large number with the help of commas just you count the commas then you will get an idea from where we have to start reading the number if three commas are there start reading from crores if you find only two commas in a large number then start reading from yes from lakhs let us see one more example so this number has only two commas so after two comma from where we have to start that's correct from lakhs so we can read this number from lakhs 62 lakhs 5632 here 10000 place is not there here is zero so here 62 lakhs 5632 let us see one more example here so here first let us put the commas after three is the first comma then after the two digits after the thousands period here we have to put the second comma so here total how many commas we have only two so two commas means we can start reading the number from lakhs four lakhs fifty six thousand three hundred twenty eight see how very simple it is reading the large numbers with the help of uh, commas i hope you understand the power and importance of uh, putting the commas let us see some examples of indian system of uh, numeration let's see and learn here we go here is the table i have taken the examples here this is the number these are the periods these are these are the places of the digits so here four is in one's place 5 is in 10th place, 2 is in 100th place, 2 again in 1000th place, 1 is in 10,000, 4 is in lakhs place. So remembering these tables, it's somewhat bit difficult for you. But when you use the commas, then it's very easy to read the number. This and these periods can also be remembered easily. But these commas are more easy. First comma is after 3 digits from the right side. Then the second comma is again after the 2 digits. So total how many commas we have here? we have the two commas so after two comma what is what is the place here the lax period so i can easily read this number by looking these commas so four lakhs twelve thousand two hundred fifty four how very simple it is everyone can read the large number with the help of a commas just to count the commas and you can start reading that number from that position so see here number name four lakhs twelve thousand two hundred fifty four in the same way then i have taken the eight digit number so first comma after three digits second comma again after two digits third comma is again after two digits i got here total three commas because this is a eight digit number now here just i am counting the commas one two three so after three comma what is the place it's a yes you are correct it's a crores period so you can start reading this number from crores let's read all together two crores one lakh twenty three thousand one hundred twenty five let us see here two crores one lakh twenty three thousand and one hundred twenty five see how very simple easily we can read the eight digit or nine digit number very easily without remembering this period's position just only with the help of a comma just only one thing you have to remember here count the commas if one comma start reading from thousand after two commas start reading from lakhs then after third comma start reading from crores see how very simple it is you can read like these numbers very easily so i hope you understand about the indian system of numeration so see you in the next video until then bye bye